Morning folks, heading into the shop. Thought we'd just do our little walk around for you guys just to show you what's been going on of late. We've been a bit slow again with the old videos, just keeps you posted on what's going on, what we're doing and how we're doing it. So, welcome to the shop for the morning. Busy as ever. Um, let's go take a look to see what we've got on, eh? Let's talk about what we've got going on in a shop. I mean, you can see, fucking tons of bikes. Um, start with these two. I think we'll do a separate video to tell you a lot about these two. Um, we have got an absolute stunning um, Yar R1. This is, um, and under here, I'll give you a sneak of this little thing. This is a zero mile Yar built one of 20 R6. So we're gonna do a separate video on these because these are for sale. So if you're in the market for something special, take a look at these. And wow, what else we got going on? Jeez, so 765, need to get that in and on the dyno. Uh, just a little annual service on this one. Full service, tires, shit. Uh, I want to repair to the stator, so we've got to put some time into this. Um, another bike that's for sale. This R1 will be going up for sale soon. Well, technically it is for sale, we just need to do a little bit of maintenance work on it. Got to get to this build barrage. This Again, this will have another video for itself, so do make sure that if you haven't liked and subscribed to the channel, do so, and you'll find out about this. This is uh, an original uh, build base superbike. Unfortunately, someone's changed the front end, but it's still got its original, I believe, Chris Mayhew engine in it. So, looking forward to getting that mapped and on the dyno. Um, geez, I can't go through every one of them, but you can see the multitude of work. But I suppose some of the stuff that you don't get to see is why we get behind on jobs. This is a great example of why we get behind on jobs. Came in for a simple fork service. Turned out that it had been uh, in a crash at some point and the internal cartridges were damaged. The outer was damaged. So basically it cascaded into being on the bench for two and a half weeks while we try and source parts, um, which obviously it takes up the bench. The entire front end was out of the bike. Um, and then we are asked to do a simple blade breed and find that the, the calipers need an overhaul. So, you know, that's a classic case of no matter how well we schedule. That schedule just goes to shit when you need to take a bike apart and can't get it off the bench. Fortunately, it's done and we've done a full overhaul of the calipers. Um, we've got a set of KTEC cartridges in here now, replacement outer, so this one's fit to fly. Uh, and again, this bad boy, this is another perfect example. Of bikes that go wrong. You come around here, Chris. Big old there. Big ol, because it needed a gearbox. Simple thing, like a gearbox overhaul, cascaded into weeks and weeks of waiting for back order parts, which people don't see. And then turns out that this bearing is knackered. So we need to change this bearing. Again, bike on the bench for literally weeks while we source parts um, and whilst we try and fix stuff and it just has a massive knock-on effect that you guys at home that you think we're behind but um or not answering the phone or stuff like that it gets rather frustrating but in reality it's because we're trying to do things like this and get out of the workshop before eight o'clock um <laughs> which is all it's all well and good and we've got loads of stuff going on around the shop so we're overhauling our suspension room up here just to bring that a little bit more into the 20th century so yeah folks literally tons doing 
I've got Ash over there tool making <laughs> to try and get that bearing out of that bloody RSV4, which we will, we will win. We'll keep you updated on that one. Rumour has it, dude, that you finished this. Seven gears? Seven, all, all seven, and overdrive. What about reverse? We didn't fit reverse on this model. This oh, is, did This is a 2020,000. That was the 1100, that yeah. reverse. It's all back together. Arse of a job, when it should have been an easy job. But that sounds nice. Have you run it? Yeah, it sounds great. Go on, really spark, nice. spark it up.